Here's what I'm using, just jig head. Looks like what, a quarter ounce? Yeah. And then piece of mullet. Piece of mullet. Oh my gosh, bull red blowing up. That's a little bit bigger. Oh yeah. Come on. Oh, oh yeah. That's great. Super nice fish right there. Somebody wanna come get this, Chad? Come, come get the fish. Come get the fish. Oh god, I can't get it out of the rod holder. <laughs> On. Yes, sir. Beautiful redfish. Doubled up on big guys. All right. All right. Look how the colors on that thing. They are beautiful. Yeah, yeah. Let me take it. That's my first bull red. I'll, I'll take a picture. Wait. Triple. Get that rod. <laughs> Well, good morning. We are here in Venice, Louisiana with Fish Finish Charters on day four of the Epic Fishing Marathon or whatever you want to call it. And we are going to go inshore fishing today. Obviously, it's before daylight. We didn't have to get up as early because the tide doesn't start until later. But we're going after bull redfish today using big live mullet and I don't know what else. But we're going with Tristan, who is the first mate from yesterday on his inshore boat right there. And we're going to catch us some big bait and big fish. Let's go. I think we're gonna get the mullet like right over there, ideally. We're all pretty tired today after several days offshore catching hundreds of pounds of tuna. Can't wait to get your boat dirty today. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> we're hanging out with Tristan this morning I'm after back. after he put us on a. 180 pound tuna on top water. So we're going after some bull reds today. That's right. All right, I'm gonna let him introduce himself on the spot. All right, go. Uh, you, you can start. It's going. All right, my name's Captain <laughs> Tristan. Uh, I do inshore and nearshore charters out of Venice, Louisiana. This morning we're gonna be targeting some monster bull reds on some cut mullet. One of my favorite things to do this time of the year. And uh, should be pretty jam up. So we're gonna Hell yeah, cut brother. some bait real quick and get out there. Got a long run all the way down river. I'm gonna give it hell. Hell yeah. The mullets are probably right there. Chad's uh, giving me hell about my poor cast net maintenance and knots and everything. That's what I did full time. Yeah, there. It's mullet time, baby. Hopefully. There they are. You want to just throw it in? Yeah, yeah. One and done, baby. You want more? Is that good? No, that's fine. Bait. We're about to do our run from Cypress Cove Marina way down to where the ocean's at, basically. And it's gonna be a little chilly. Doubled up. Well, guys, we have, we have, we have, we have, we have, we have.
doubled up here. Doubled up. And now beautiful, we're filming it. Now beautiful we're filming it. Venice, Italy. Actually, Louisiana. <laughs> we are catching bull redfish with Captain Christian here. Look at this on his phone. We're going to put the first one in the boat right I mean, it's game on. He's like, throw over there. You should get bit pretty quick. And indeed, I got bit pretty quick. Yeah, these fight very similar to a strike. Uh, no, sorry, sorry. Yeah, you good? That means there's another one. Come on, baby. Let's go. I think Chad's there. Watch out, I gotta go front. Yep. Everybody move. Yep. He's going for the trolling motor. You good? You good. Madness. 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 That is madness. What came out? Keeps going. Let's go, babies. Big one. Double, 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 double. Very nice, very nice. Heck yeah. Look at that. Beautiful redfish, doubled up on big guys. All right, all right. I'm gonna get those. Look how the color's on that thing. They are beautiful. Yeah, yeah, you want a picture with this one? Yeah, let me take it. That's my first bull red. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll take a picture. Wait, triple. Get that rod. <laughs> Uh, no, he's on there. He's just real. He's just coming at you. Here, uh, switch with me. Okay. So I can get you a picture. I'm gonna leave the camera going. All right. We on. Nice. And yeah, we're on again. On again. We haven't even had time to like turn the camera going. Like, <laughs> throwing bait down. They keep going down. Right here, that one just got hit. Oh. Yep. Yep. That one's on. Somebody come get get it. Uh -oh, I think. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, go yeah, down. there's one on there. No, I'm on it, I think. I think I'm on it. Or it's swimming and going up the beach. How are we? It's not. Uh, that looks good. That looks good. Yep, good work. You want to do it? I think I can do it. Gosh, she's dogging me. Get up here. Look at those big head shakes. Big tail kicks. Oh boy. Ooh, that rise doubled over. Love it. <laughs> Four drag, jeez. 
Oh god, he's got a good one. That's a horse. That's like a horse. Yeah. That's a horse. <laughs> Is that a shark or just a giant? That's a giant bull red, probably. Yeah, you look at him on top, oh, running. Oh, that was cool. You got a jumbo on the man. Like, you can see some bait in the water and all swirling around, too. Gosh, they just dog you. You must have done this before, huh? Once or twice. Oh, yeah! Yes, sir. <laughs> Whoa! I've done that once or twice too. Here we go. All right. Nice. Oh! Let's go, baby! <laughs> All right, we're about to get this horse in. Oh, baby! Look at him! Look at him go! Look at him go! Get on in here, buddy. Come get in the boat. Up. Just lift up. What a tub. Two tubs up front. One and a two. <laughs> and a three. And a three. Oh, we put it. And a three. I right, put it down. Dang it. I got debated, boys. I got debated. Okay. Ready? Let's go. Oh, we're on. Again. Okay, well, we're going to release this these is real this. quick. This is our second or third triple. Not a bad one. He's good. Yeah, just, just grab them by the tail. tail. And then, push. yeah, give them that little... That one's oh, ready. he's gone. Okay, cool. Right. There we go. He's just recuperating. On again. Hold on. Put a little more heat on him. There we go. Look, I'm gonna throw this big old head. Throw whatever you want. Throw a whole mullet in there. See what happens. <laughs> We're gonna get some head on the head. <laughs> Just like that, baby. All right. We're gonna chunk her out there. In the danger zone. All right, y'all switch sides with each other. There you go. Put that one in the rod holder and get the tape down. I think we got a couple. I'm just gonna keep it rolling. Our cat's gonna keep it rolling. We'll do the net job for you. Right there. There it is. Look, get him. <laughs> as soon as you throw it out there, <laughs> as soon as you, we about to throw a whole mullet. What do you think? Oh my gosh, this is. Hey, this is crazy. This is crazy. This is crazy. Let's go. We got pre final weather conditions. If you guys look up, and they are we call chewing. this pig fishing weather. They are chewing. And they are chewing. Yeah, when they're running, you don't really have to reel that hard on them. Just kind of let them do their thing. You're just trying to kind of wear them out. Way out there. Look at him. He's coming up like a striper. Let's see if we can get a triple. They are doing it. They doing it just like the tuna last night. Ah, pick him on drag. Get up here. I think he's got a little bit of one. Got him. Fish in the boat. Okay, I'll hook that guy. All right. Nice. All catch and release. Yep, circle hooks. Just right there. Oh yeah, look we'll at him rolling. Clean bad. Alright, here we go, I'm gonna release mine. Nice guy, this is probably the smallest one we've caught all morning. That's saying something. We'll put him back. Beautiful. There he goes. We got that one. Chad may get bumped here in a second. I'm gonna try to get another bait out. Throw this whole low mullet out. <laughs> you want me to cut something off of them or just chuck them out? I'd, I'd just try and throw, like, 
you know. I wouldn't even. I just throw, throw the whole thing. Yes. All right, we're gonna throw this whole mullet, you guys. Whole mullet. After a bull red, you're gonna watch it live ish. I think Chad just got bit. Back down here. Hey. <laughs> I mean, shit. I keep adding drag to you. Here we go, guys. Here's the whole mullet going down the hatch. <laughs> when we catch a big mammoth channel. Okay. Okay. We catch the fish. Right yeah, when he's running, you can just hold him like just like that. Just, and then when he, yeah, when he's not running, you reel. There you go. Captain has become the cameraman. I am the cameraman. <laughs> oh, boy, just got tabbed. What a beast. What a great morning, Captain. <laughs> he put us on him. I think he got a real good one. Yeah, that's a good oh, one. That's a big one. Real good one. Mean one, too. Lord, they fight so hard. They don't give up. There's yeah. no quit. A striker would have done quit by now. Well, actually, they fight harder in the summer when the water heats up. Yeah. Right now, they're still kind of lethargic, but... uh. Yeah, it's still a good good battle for sure. We got some head on the head, as I said. <laughs> there it is. You heard it here first. Head on the head. No quit. They just don't stop. Lord have mercy. What a morning. More drag, more drag. I've been. I'm gonna give him a little heat. That rod <laughs> just bowed over. I get him. Wait, you see the head? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's the biggest one in the morning. All right. Whew. Oh, Warner. Thirty pounds. <laughs> oh yeah, at least yeah. Oh, that's a horse. Look at the head that's on this a thing. That's a horse. Look how wide he is. Way to go, my man. <laughs> this is a real big one. This is a real big one. Look at that thing, you guys. Look at the head on it. <laughs> nice. Uh -oh. Hey, here's one. Here's one. Somebody want to come get this, Chad? Come in. Come, come, in. come get the fish. Come get the fish. Oh, God, I can't get it out of the rod holder. <laughs> fish on. Oh, fish on. on. Fish on. Fish on. I may bring that whole yeah. mold in just to get it out of your way. Okay, go ahead. I'll hold that. We'll just pause, pause in the action, action, a brief bait switching intermission. We got Chad hooked up here on a horse and we got a horse right here too. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, let's release him. Back in the water. Glug, glug. Look at the head on that thing. That's a good one. Chad's got one taking him out to the ocean. Out to the ocean. I put one more bait back there. That's all we got in the water is one right now with that whole mold on it. How'd you feel there, Chad? What do you got over there? I got a big one. Yeah? Chaddy no? yo I I got a big one here. He's ripping. I thought I was going to try to horse him in for a second, but that didn't, that didn't work. Didn't work. He horsed me back. Coming up. This is the most fun. Crazy. There we go, baby. Working them up, working them up. There's that fish. Coming to the boat. Nice old red. The colors on them are just beautiful. Cat broke out a big bait. Great fish, great fish. That's another jumbo. Another jumbo. There's Chad's jumbo. Another one. Crazy. Yeah. Let's buddy. go. Out of way. You guys need to come down here and do this. Catch some big tuna, some big reds. We got one bait of soaking right now. So what are we doing right here? We are 
We whacked the bull red, so I'm gonna just rig up the typical slot red rig here. It's a popping cork. I like 40 pound leader to a jig head. Okay. And, uh, dead shrimp. Now, what's a slot red for people who don't know? Uh, it's a redfish in between 16 and 27 inches. Okay. Here we're allowed five a person in that range and one over 27 inches. Okay. I typically don't like to keep bull reds because they don't, they're not the best table fare and they're a breeder fish. Yeah. I think it's cooler to take some pictures with them and put them back, put them back in the water. Um, now the smaller ones are absolutely delicious on the grill. So. Yeah, that's what I'm, I'm excited to get some of those. Oh yeah. And then he's got a popping cork yep, with a, a weight below it. Yep, jig head, real simple. Anything clack, that clack. stinks and has some flesh, yeah, go, uh, go find it. Or smash it. We're gonna go try the slots here in a second. So we have something on that's not bull ready. Pull him up there. Daggum stingray. R.I.P. my homie. What was the alligator guy's name? Steve Irwin. Steve Irwin. We hate you. Okay, give me a little more slack on it. Pop the bill. Yeah, or do that. To me. This is fun. I'm getting hit. That's about to go down. Yeah, wait for it, wait for it. He's on. I think I have another stingray. Okay, I think I have a stingray on this. Maybe not. That doesn't look too stingray-ish. Not stingray? I don't know. Oh my goodness. You think it's stingray-ish? I don't know. He's like staying down. Maybe a bigger one. Really? Did you go to school? I'm, I'm thinking stingray again. again. Okay. Just nice. dead weight. Yeah. That's cool. Come on, buddy. We got some giant waves out here right now, too. Come on, get up here. Tell you what, we're having a blast, and we've been out here an hour and a half, and we've already caught our fill of big giant bull reds, so we're going to go after some eater ones for table fare. We're bringing home tuna, some wahoo, and hopefully some redfish back to Tennessee. Cook up. I bet this is a stingray. it's a little shark. I don't know. It's either a stingray or a shark. Oh god, he's going to the front. No, it's a red. He's just fighting There he goes. There he goes. So from here to Expecting that to be a redfish. Woo! I'm wore out. We're bringing out the mullet. And he's got his power pulled down in the back with the shallow water anchors. And we're on this point right here, and we're watching these reds move in and out of these reeds. It looks like and he's cutting us up some fresh bait on that popping cork rig he showed us. And I guess we just throw it out there. Yep, right up next to the cane. Do they smoke it when they hit it a lot of times? Yeah, sometimes it'll be a, like a sl slow drag down, sometimes it'll rip it. Sick. Is that one right there, or is that a bird? That's a bird. 
bird. Well, I'm excited. Chunk and bonka. Pop it or no need? Yep. Pop it and let it sit? Mm -hmm. Okay. He'll even bait your hook for you. How about that? All right, where you want me to chug it? That way? Yeah, right on this Okay. Close up in it. How deep is it right there? Reel it in at all or just leave it and pop it? Okay. Just more visual I'm for the cut. Uh, yeah, I'm up. Got him, Chad. Slot. Slot red. There we go. We got dinner. We got dinner, baby. Get him in there, Chad. Oh yeah, look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful. Nicely done, Chad. That's dinner, dude. Oh, I just got hit. You put it down though. Come back. On. Yes, sir. Got him. Hooks on. Triple. Triple. There we go, baby. Oh, this is fun. I love watching that little bobber go under. You come off. It's like bluegill fishing, but bigger and more fun. Chad's still learning how to cast. Oh my gosh! Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, baby, get up here. Oh, look how pretty that fish is. That's a nice one. Beautiful fish. Beautiful fish, Cap. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Turn that red right there. Is that a good one? Yeah, that's a Beautiful fish. Oh, yeah, I'm going to let the captain hold on. I've been on camera all week. He going to make some good dinner. I smacked him. Chad's back in the zone. Come on, come get it. And that hook got him. Those are some good jigs. Let's see. Woo. Yes, sir. In the box. Here's what I'm using, just jig head. Looks like, what, a quarter ounce? Yeah. And then piece of mullet. Piece of mullet. Casting skill. Yeah. I'm gonna get it up in the reeds right there. Ooh, that's that's money, dude. Look at him up in the reeds over there too. Oh yeah, I'm sure they're everywhere. They're, they're coming over here going, what the going on over here? Where'd Timmy go? Where'd Jimmy go? They're like, we gotta come over here and see. A piece of mullet. I got one. Got him. Get out of them reeds. Oh boy. 
Okay. Get on out here. Let's go, buddy. Oh, perfect. Trade you. Woo, loudy. Beautiful, beautiful. Beautiful. They are biting. They are on. We can see them running bait up in the reeds. This is cool. I like this. I like reeling in 20 bull reds too in about an hour. Look at them right there. I mean, I know. That's the one. <laughs> I'm gonna fling them back up in there. Let's see. Let's go see if we can get three on the same bait. Give them a little pop. Now we wait. Now we wait. Come and eat this tasty mullet, Mr. Redfish. I'm gonna get me a fresh piece here. Fresh piece from the goodie box. The booty cheek piece. Okay. Where you want me to go? Past you? Okay. My tip's tangled. Money shot? I kind of like that one. Money? Let's see. Alright, Cap's gonna come in here and show us how it's done. Come on, Cap. 1001, 1002. <laughs> That was sick. Was that not sick? <laughs> I got that on camera too. That was cool. Do they do that a lot? Really? I scared the shit out of them. We got the jumping red here. Captain said they don't do that. They do, but not like not that. a lot. He yeah. went airborne. Yeah, he went like two or three feet out of the water. That was sick. Nice. <laughs> Captain's boxing me out on the money spot. <laughs> here, switch for Nah, I don't care. You're good. I'm gonna go. Uh, I don't know. I may try to get up back in there. Risk it for the biscuit, one would say. I'm going to just let it dangle there. What do you think? It'd be awesome if they can see. Captain's it. on. They're not. Snag. All right, I got, it. I got it down. Okay, now I got it in the money zone. Start hammering them. Oh, he put it down. Dang it. I'm an idiot. I think I got debated, y'all. Really? Okay, you're right. I am not debated. Oh my gosh, bull red's blowing up. Captain's got one on. Uh oh. Look at him. Is that you? Yeah. Okay. I was like, is that one chasing a mullet? What the heck's going on? Uh, they're all over the place. You got your pretty good one there, Cap? What's that? You got your pretty good one there? Oh, yeah. A releaser, I believe. A releaser, not in the greaser. Ooh, that's a good one. They ain't liking my head. Oh, that's a good one. Here, I'll net for him. Oh, you got it. Never mind. I'm keeping fishing. 
Ooh, I love catching them up here shallow. This is fun. This is fun. What we got 20 pound braid, 40 pound leader? 30 pound braid, 40 pound leader. And going back towards the power poles. We're doing a wrap around. This is a good fish. Think it's big of the day? No. No? Look at that drag. Look at that. He didn't like that. Did not like it at all. That is so crazy. They're right here too. I'm gonna try to get one out, y'all. That thing is going. What do we got? Just a big old bruiser. They're boiling next to the boat. So wacky. Is that a lighter rod? Yeah. Or, okay. Ah, oh, extra fun. I have a lot of drag on it too. It's not like I have a loose drag. Dude, that's a big one. He is big. Yeah, he's big. Uh, that's big. Just fighting like mad. Dude. Dude, that's got to be the biggest one of the day. Oh, not ready. Dude, that's big. What in the heck? That's the biggest one of the day. Yeah. Look at the back on him. I think it is. There we go. There we go. <laughs> oh my God, Captain. Dude. <laughs> Tristan. <laughs> Pretty fun on that light tackle. Too. That is awesome. That's a, that's a horse. What do you think, 25, 28 pounds? Yeah, yeah, around 25. Very nice. Hold that sucker up there. They are so pretty. What a beautiful fish, man. What a beautiful fish. See the purple in him? Yeah. Green. Look at the purple on him. You have an awesome fishery down here, Captain. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Pretty blessed to fish it every day. He's gone. Just like that. Oh, he's got him a slot. Got him a slot. That's the slot hole right there. Oh yeah, we eating good tonight, or tomorrow. Chad's got one. Yeah, he does. <laughs> Get him. Get him, Chad. That's so sick.
Oh, that's a perfect size one. Shmoney. Oh, look how pretty. Yeah. Look at his eye. Gorgeous, gorgeous. <laughs> oh, he's on. I can't catch shit now. I didn't cut my piece. Hey, this is a good slot fish over here, guys. They are on. Look at that. Show us that fish. We out here big chilling after wearing out jumbos. Now that's the eater right there. Yeah, perfect, perfect fillet. Got him, Chad. Yes, sir. That cork was like kathunk. Oh, that's a beautiful one, Chad. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. A little drag, a little drag. Oh, yeah. A little drag. He's on the upper end of that slot size. Yeah. He is on the upper end of that slot size. Such a beautiful fish. <laughs> it's so fun. We're striper fishing in one foot of water. Yeah, literally. With a lot more bites. Yes. Striper fishing in one foot of water. Does he make it? He does. Put him in there. Put him in the box. In the box. Go swimming. Ah. Yeah. What a good day. Awesome day. That's how you do it. That makes it. <laughs> and we're done before one. Yeah. Done before one. Got plenty of time. That's a little bit bigger. Uh oh. I have a bull, I think. Maybe. I do. That's the bull hole over there. Here we go. This is gonna be our last redfish in Venice. Or mine. Ever? No, I'll be Ever? back. No, 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 no. No, no, no. This month. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta get Katie down here to do this stuff. Last redfish this month. Oh yeah. Come on. Yeah, that was my first time ever offshore. Other than on a head boat, which doesn't really count. Oh my goodness. Dude, this thing's still going. Gosh. He's just dogging me. My forearm is on fire from catching all these fish the past couple days. Oh, a good one. Okay. Taking everything I just got back. Come on. All right, you're getting a little heat. Look at him, look at him, look at him. Well, we're going over here now. Trying to keep his head up. Oh, he's a good one. Still going. Look at the head on him. They're fighting the hardest I've seen in this year. 
The mouth on them's huge. Yes, sir. Oh yeah. That's pretty. Super nice fish Super right nice. there. All right, my final bull red of this trip. We had a great time with Captain Tristan. I'm gonna go release him. He's green. Gone. Just a big boil and goodbye. Well, we have uh, made it back to Cypress Cove Marina with Captain Tristan. We still gotta clean a few reds. We're heading back to the Fish Finish Charters house, condo. But we've had a hell of a couple days. Definitely. Nuts. Almost a 200 pound tuna last night. I don't even know how many bull reds we got today. And giant wahoos, just everything. Just crazy, crazy, crazy. We all hit it right for sure. We, we did. At the right time, good weather. It was okay. beautiful. And uh, I'm about to fall asleep right now, and I'm sunburned to death, it looks like. But uh, we have a hell of a time, hell of a time. We got the Bubba Blade, electric, the easy way. Show us how to do it on the old Bubba Blade. Probably time for new blades. They get a workout. Yoink. Bam. Easy peasy. Well, this is our final day here in Venice, and we are headed back home to East Tennessee after one hell of a trip with Fish Finish Charters here in the Fish Mecca, where there's only fish. There ain't nothing else. We had just a blast. We caught giant wahoos, huge tuna. My first tuna ever on a topwater that was 175 pounds. Just crazy, crazy craziness. And uh, we've got a bunch of food to bring home with us. All the coolers are filled, other than the bait one here. That'd be pretty nasty. And uh, yeah, so. Just, just a fish, fishing trip of a lifetime. Every single time I come down here, when you time the weather, weather right, like we did this time, it was just on. We were able to get offshore and just do whatever we wanted to do. And it was just absolutely sick. So if you guys are interested in doing uh, some offshore stuff, uh, Captain Aaron and Captain Aaron are the best in the business. Aaron's a uh, young guy like myself, but he's hardcore and crazy about it and super passionate. As you can tell in the videos, I'm probably gonna leave some stuff unedited with just everybody screaming at each other because that's real that's what happens when you're hooked up with a monster and uh eddie's the exact same way he's just been doing it for 40 years or however long he's an og down here um and aaron's will be one in the future and i can't wait to come back down so thanks for watching uh we'll have links to all uh, the guide stuff below uh thanks to tristan uh for the bull redfish i mean that was crazy i mean i'm probably forgetting stuff right now but i mean i've just had a crazy trip absolutely exhausted and we got a 10-hour drive ahead of us back to east Tennessee. but damn if it wasn't worth it we'll catch you next time on top knocks fishing thanks for watching